Minecraft build challenge with my friend. But any build I draw will be built into existence. So, for example, if I go up to my dry canvas and draw a normal wooden house, when I go ahead and flip this lever, that exact build will spawn in. Oh, my gosh. And I'm going to be drawing insane builds throughout the video. So, Smirky, are you ready to start the build battle? Yes, I am, Cardi. Okay, so to start, let's go to this dispenser and see what we have to build. Oh, my gosh. What will we get? Well, let's look at the paper, and it looks like we got castle. Okay, so Smirky, we have to build a castle, so let's get to building. Let's go! So now that the build battle has officially begun, we can start drawing our castle. And this is gonna be super duper cool because Smirky actually doesn't have one of these drawing canvases, so he's just gonna be building like normal. But anyways, I wanna make the coolest drawing ever, so let's go into this canvas and I think we should just start drawing our castle. So to start off, I kinda wanna add a little giant water moat around the entire castle. So I'm just gonna start with that just to show you guys this is going to work So I drew a little thing like that and then let's just put a lever right here And then we'll flip this lever and it should spawn that exact thing in so let's pull this And oh my gosh, I think it might have worked because look at this There's this massive moat all around this giant area where I think we're gonna make the castle And look, it's literally going outside of my plot I think that means our castle is gonna be super duper big But it looks like this water is a little bit messy so I'm gonna have to clear this up a little bit by destroying some of the grass blocks inside of here. And there we go. I think that's pretty good for now, and I really like how this turned out. Because what we'll be able to do is, is we'll be able to draw a little tiny bridge so we can get across this water moat. And then, of course, we'll build the giant castle right there in the middle. I have some crazy plans, and I cannot wait to draw these things. But before I start drawing my castle, I actually do have a little bit of a seeker here set up in this wall. You see, over here, I have this tiny little blue button. And what do you press this blue button? Well, I guess you guys are about to see what's gonna happen. So let's press this right now. And oh my gosh, look at the bedrock wall. It just turned into one-way glass. Now we can see what Smirky's building. And as you can see, he is literally just building by hand. And look at this castle. This thing is pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie. But it is gonna be really, really bad compared to my giant castle that I'm gonna draw. And look at what Smirky's doing. I guess we could get a little bit of inspiration for our drawing from this. It looks like he has this massive gate entrance. And then he's starting to add these little triangle things on top of each of the pillars. Okay, I think we should do both of those. And of course, make these stone walls just like he has. But anyways, now that we've seen his build, we'll check in on this later. But for now, let's just press this blue button again. And boom, it is all back to bedrock. But now we really need to start drawing our castle. So let's go up to the canvas, right click this. And now let's get to work. So I think we're gonna need to start off with this gray color. Because the gray is gonna be the majority of the castle. Because, you know, castles are all made out of stone, so I think what I wanna do is just make this little wall just like this. And then I'm gonna make some pillars back here, just like this, and then I wanna make a giant pillar right there. And I remember how Smirky had those triangles on top of each of those pillars. Well, I'm gonna draw those just like this. So here we go, I'm drawing them, and I think this is looking pretty cool because we got these crazy dark triangle roofs on top of each of the stone pillars. And now I wanna add a giant giant wooden door right there at the front of the castle, right in front of the moat. And then, of course, we'll build a little wooden bridge to actually get across the water moat. And there we go. I think that's pretty good for the base of the castle. And now what I'm actually gonna do is just add a little bit of green coming down the castle to act as some vines. Because if there's vines on a castle, that's how you know it's super ancient and super cool. So I'm gonna draw, like, four of these vines going down the castle. And then what I'm gonna do now is make little roofs all across the castle. And I know it might look a little confusing but I'm pretty sure this is gonna look really, really good when we pull the lever. And speaking of pulling the lever, I think we should honestly just pull it like this. This will allow us to spot in that castle and see if we need to do any cool changes to it. So let's pull this lever in three, two, one, and let's go. And oh my gosh, I think it might have worked. Look at this. This is insane. Wait, wait, wait. We gotta go across this drawbridge that I drew. And then let's just walk into this castle. And whoa, this thing is completely decked out in the interior. Look, it has a bunch of bookshelf stairs, literally a piano, and there's even an upstairs.
Tyler's way. This is so cool, but let's break outside because I want to see if this thing turned out exactly like the drawing. So let's go out like this. And oh my gosh, look at this thing. It has all those pillars we built. It even has the giant one in the middle. And of course, it has these giant dark wood spikes on the top of each pillar. This is epic. Look, we can literally go inside of these things and they're like archer towers. We can see the entire world from up here and we can even shoot our bow down at the wall. This is so insane. And Spurk is gonna be so surprised how we managed to build this entire thing in such a short time. But in reality, we were just cheating with this drawing mod. But I think this castle could actually use a little bit of an upgrade. And you might be asking yourself, how on earth are we gonna upgrade a castle that's already this cool looking? Well, what if we added like a giant dragon like right at the side of the castle and it's like attacking the castle? That would be epic. But I have no idea how to build a dragon. So of course, we're gonna have to go down to our little drawing canvas and we're gonna have to draw a dragon. Okay, so I'm not really the best at drawing dragons, but I'm gonna try my best here. So since we've already spotted this castle, we can remove a little area at the top right of it just like this so we can fit the dragon. And what I wanna do is I wanna make it a black and yellow lightning dragon. So to start off, let's just make a little dragon head just like this. So this will be the mouth and then that'll be the eye right there. And then let's make a body for this thing and then we're gonna draw its wings now. And okay, this is not turning out that good. I'm gonna be honest, but it should be really cool. We pull this lever. So now I'm adding the yellow parts on its wings just like this and I think this is super epic and look at that dragon. I really hope that this painting mod picks up that that's actually a dragon and spawns it exactly what I want. So I guess without further ado, let's just pull this lever and see what we can get. And okay, I think something happened and look at this. The dragon actually spawned it and whoa, this is exactly what I wanted. It's a massive black dragon with these yellow ears and whoa, look at that mouth. And of course, there's the giant and stone yellow wings that I drew. This is epic. And I think it actually is electric because that's why there's all this glowstone on it. Well, this adds a great addition to the castle. But anyways, it's been a little while since we pressed this blue button and let's see what Smirky's been up to. And whoa, oh my gosh, look at this. This thing is actually super cool looking and it looks like he's stacking a bunch of these wooden houses in the middle. And look, he's adding like these little glass domes around it. And look, he has a bunch of cactuses and a little lava moat surrounding it. Well, honestly, props to Smirky because this thing is pretty cool looking. But obviously, it is nowhere near as cool looking as my castle. Because mine's super ancient and super medieval and a thousand times bigger than his. And anyway, Smirky, how is your build going? Because we're running out of time. My build is almost done. I'm building the last thing. Whoa, Smirky, I bet your build looks really cool, but there's no way it looks as cool as mine. Uh, yeah, it definitely does look as cool as yours. Mine looks really cool. Oh, yours looks really cool, Smirky. I'm sure it looks cool, but there's no way it's that big, right? Uh, it's pretty big, Cardi. My build is actually so, 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 so much better than yours. It's actually super secure, and a lot of people can live here. Okay, Smirky. Well, the time is now up, and that means we're gonna have to review each other's builds. Oh, uh, okay. Well, I'm excited to compare mine, because I'm definitely gonna win. Okay, Smirky can't hear me, but let's just press this button to turn the wall back to bedrock. And boom. Okay, Smirky, come meet at the dispenser where we started. All right, I'm here now. Okay, let's look at your house first and just give me a quick little tour of what your place looks like. So I have a super dangerous moat with lava, soul sand, and some cactuses. And then over here, I have the entrance and I'll show you the interior of my house inside the castle. So inside here, I got my chair and a TV and two lamps. And then I got the next five houses stacked on top of this. Oh my gosh, this thing is crazy, Smirky. This is not even a castle. I mean, it has a little bit of a castle wall. But what's this massive bubble of water? Uh, this is my pet fishes, Cordy. Why? What does it look like? These are not fishes, Smirky. These are guardians. They're gonna attack your world. No, they are, Cardi. These guys are fish. They're friendly. Okay, Smirky, if you think so. But I rate this build a 2 out of 10. A uh, 2 out of 10, Cardi. This build is super duper cool. Ah, uh, Smirky, I mean, it is pretty cool. But compared to my build, it is not that cool. Oh, well, let me see your build then. Because I bet my build is way, 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 way better. All right, let's go. And look at this thing, Smirky. Do you see this castle I built? Whoa, how on earth did 
dude, you build this in the time we have, Cordy. You are literally a pro builder. I know I am, Smirky. I just am super good at placing blocks. Like, I placed every single one of the blocks here. Placing all the blocks must have taken a really long time. And what? Is that a dragon up here? Yup, I literally even have a dragon on my build. Look at this guy. He is an electric dragon, and he is attacking the castle. An electric dragon? It looks like one, too. Is this electricity coming out of it? Yes, it is. And look at the interior of my castle. It is literally all decorated. Oh my gosh, there is no way you decorated this entire build. I was going to say your thing is a 9 out of 10, but since it has an interior, it might be a 10 out of 10. And what? You're literally insane for building all this what? I know I'm insane, Smirky, but do you know what this means? Yeah, it means you win. Okay, I'm gonna have to get you back in the second round, but this is actually just uh, insane, Cardi. How did you build this? Smirky, you do not need to worry about how I'm such a pro builder, and anyways, let's reset the arena, and then we'll choose our next build. All right, well, I'm gonna make sure I build a way, way, way better next build than you. Let's go! And boom, as you can see, we reset the arena, and Smirky, are you ready to see what our next build is. Yes, I am, Gordy, and hopefully it's a really, really easy theme for me. Well, let's see, and it looks like we got boats, Murky. A boat? Okay, well, this is hopefully gonna be really easy, but it might be a little bit hard. Yeah, it might be a little bit hard, Murky, but let's get to building now. Let's go. And since we gotta build a boat, of course, we're not gonna actually be building a boat. We're gonna be drawing a boat. So let's go over to our canvas, and what should we draw? Well, I'm thinking can we draw like a massive titanic looking boat because the titanic is a massive massive ship and if we could draw that that means we're gonna have a huge build like an actually massive 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 build it'll be like a thousand blocks wide and that will be so epic so he's gonna be so confused so right now i just draw a little bit of a red bottom to the ship and then i'm drawing the black base of it and then now i need to add a little white top to it and now at the back of this ship i'm gonna make it a little bit taller because this is where all the seats and captain areas are. And now I'm gonna add a little bit more details to the ship like a giant wooden pole with a bunch of little chains coming down to the ship. Then I'm gonna make little steam engines coming out the top like this. And then now let's add a bunch of little windows all across the ship. This thing might not look that cool, but trust me, when we're gonna pull this lever, it is gonna spot in the craziest ship ever. And there we go. I think we got all the windows in there, and I think this boat is pretty much complete. Hopefully the painting mod will understand exactly what we just drew, and it will spawn that in. And anyways, let's just grab ourselves a lever and place this right next to the canvas like this. And oh my gosh, I'm so excited to see this thing spotted. I cannot wait. Let's just pull this right now. And let's see if this thing worked. And what just spawned in? This thing is massive. I did not think it was going to be this big. Like, I knew it was going to be a pretty big boat, but what is this? This thing is actually a thousand blocks long. It has so much detail and furniture all across it. Like, look at that. That's the giant wooden pole I drew, and then it even has the little strings and wires coming from it. And look, it even has these lifeboats and chairs and everything everywhere. And then if we go all the way to the front of the ship, we can see the captain's quarters, and this is where the ship is literally drove. This is the steering wheel, and I literally drew none of this stuff. The mod just bought this stuff in because it knew it was a giant boat I was drawing. This is actually gonna be one of the coolest builds in Minecraft ever, and oh my gosh, I'm so happy we have this. Like, he's gonna have no idea how how on earth we built this in such a short time. But wait, why is there like water coming down from the back of this? And wait a second, I just realized something. We built a massive boat, but we forgot to put the water down. Oh my gosh, what was I thinking? A boat out of water doesn't even make sense. Okay, we're gonna have to go back to our canvas and quickly draw in some water. So we're just gonna make a massive pool of water down here. And boom, I think that should be pretty good. And let's just pull this lever. And boom, okay, that definitely worked because onto the canvas literally turned the water. And there we go. Look at this entire thing. It's all water. Well, I think our ship is pretty much complete at this point. And this thing is just so big. Oh my gosh. I can't believe that we actually have something this big. It's so cool. But I just realized something. We haven't looked at Smokey's build at all during this round. So let's go down 
to our little button right here and press this. And boom, it all turned to one-way glass. And oh my gosh, look at Smirky's boat. He is nowhere near complete. He has this tiny little like 10 block wide thing. And I have a massive Titanic boat. That's a thousand blocks wide. And there's probably like 10 million blocks making this entire thing. Smirky literally has no idea how on earth I'm building these things this fast. But before we drop the walls and we reveal each other's builds, I want to do a little bit of a prank on Smirky. So what I actually want to do is I want to draw a giant gun system on top of the Titanic boat. And I want it to be going over the wall. And then we're going to shoot some crazy TNTs onto Smirky's build. And I know that's a little bit mean, but I think it's going to be really, really funny. So let's go down to our painting and we just got to draw a crazy gun system right at the middle here. So since we already got the main part of it built, let's just erase a big section here so we can fit this thing in. And now I'm just going to draw this thing up like this. And then let's draw a little gray thing on top. And then we'll put a bit of red in there to show that it's super evil. Now I think that should be pretty good. So now we actually just got to place a lever here since it got destroyed by this water. Just like that. And wait, it just gets destroyed. Okay, we're going to have to place this lever and pull it super fast. So let's just place this and pull it in three, two, one. And here we go. And boom, I think I pulled the lever. So let's go look up here and see if the gun's there. And I think it is. Look at this gun. It literally just made a giant black pillar coming out the top of this thing. And look at this. It literally goes all the way over across the bedrock wall onto Smirky's side. And okay, hopefully he doesn't look up because we are literally just cheating right now by looking over the wall. But anyways, it looks like it has the red at the end just like I drew. And look, it even has this lever connected to some redstone and some redstone repeaters. Wait, I think this is how we activate the gun. So I guess maybe we should just pull this lever and it will shoot some sort of explosive onto his build. So let's get one last good look at Smirky's boat build. And now let's get to our lever and I think we should just pull this thing. Let's see what it's gonna do. And uh, what's happening down there? Is anything happening yet? Oh no, oh my gosh. Wait, what is happening? What? There's a bunch of insane TNT just landing all across his build. This thing is massive. It's making these crazy explosions all across the arena and oh my gosh i think his build is completely ruined what just happened my boat is ruined wait we're about to talk to smirky but first let's set up this one-way glass like this and boom it's all glass and um smirky why do i hear you complaining on your side gordy it's because my ship hit an iceberg oh my gosh your ship hit an iceberg does that mean it got completely ruined yes if the water was deeper on my side the ship would be sinking right now. Smirky, are you sure that there wasn't like a massive gun that blew up your ship? Or are you sure that it was an iceberg? Party, how would a massive gun blow up my ship? It was definitely an iceberg. You know what they do to ships. Oh, I guess you're right. It was definitely an iceberg. But anyway, Smirky can't hear me. So let's just go down to this button and turn this wall back to bedrock. And boom, that looks good. And um, now, Smirky, the time is unfortunately out, so you're not gonna have time to repair your build. Oh, Oh, no, I didn't think I would have enough time anyways. I spent so long making it really good. Well, Smirky, I guess let's just do a tour of each other's build. So I'll go on your side first and then give me a little tour of your boat. All right. Well, uh, Cardi, this was my boat. I mean, it's made out of iron blocks and netherite because, uh, I don't know, I didn't want it to sink. And then up here is the control room and there's not really anything left because it all blew up. Oh, Smirky, this is so trash. This is nowhere near as good as mine, Smirky. Party, it's trash because it got blown up. What are you saying? It would be trash even if it didn't get blown up. I, get, I give this a zero out of ten. And anyways, let's go on to my ship and you might be able to see it from here. A zero out of ten. And what, what is this, Cardi? This is a ten out of ten. Once again, wait, can you please give me a tour? This looks insane. Well, Smirky, I don't even know if we have enough time this would be like an hour tour but anyways i'll show you a little bit of stuff there's like lifeboats here this is the control room with the steering wheel and then this is the front of the ship what you built all of this in how long i think we have like 20 minutes yeah it's murky i built this all in 20 minutes this is so insane like look there's even a thousand different hotel rooms in here oh my gosh you have built a thousand hotel rooms how did you do that smirky you do not even need to work about how I place so many blocks in such a short amount of time. And anyways, I think that should be good for that round. Yeah, you literally planned out so many rooms out here. 
here at like this in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, I can't even count this all. I know, Smirky. I can't even figure out where you are because this thing is massive in any ways. Smirky, let's reset the arena so we can move on to the last round. The last round. Oh my gosh. I'm burning down your ship. Hey, stop it. And Smirky, we are finally on the final round. And do you know what's special about this final round? I have no idea. It's a special blitz round. That means we only have two minutes to make our build. Two minutes. Okay, well, you are not going to have enough time to make whatever crazy thing you want to do. Okay, we'll see about that. And anyways, let's see what we're going to build. And it looks like we're building a statue. So let the time start now. Statue? Whoa, that's kind of hard. But I can build one super duper fast. Let's go. Okay, so like I said, this is a blitz route. So we only have two minutes. But luckily, I'll still be able to make an insane build because I'm going to draw something really, really fast. So for my build, I kind of want to build a giant human monster. And I'm literally gonna make him kneeling down, kind of. So right now, I'm drawing the little kneeling down pose. And then I'm gonna make a body on him. And I'm gonna make some arms. And then I'm gonna make a head. And then let's add a little mouth on this guy. And then make a giant rock that he'll be holding right above his head. And this is kind of hard to see because I'm running out of room. But this should be really cool. And I kind of did rush this build a lot. But it's because we have barely any time. But for one last detail, I want to add these yellow lines all around his body. Just to make it look extra, extra cool. And make it look like I spent a lot more time building it. So let's just go like this. And I think this is good. Look at this crazy statue build. So now let's grab ourselves a lever. And let's place this lever right next to this. And I think we're running out of time. But let's just pull this right now. And oh my gosh. I think it might have worked. Because look at what spawned in. I can't even write this entire thing in at once. So I'm about to go in spectator mode and look at this thing. It is a massive kneeling human knight. And oh my gosh. Is he holding the rock like I drew? And he definitely is. Look at this. It's a giant floating island up here. There's even a bunch of grass. If I had more time, I would definitely build something on top of this boulder. But since we literally only have like 30 seconds left, this is gonna be spectacular. Smirky's gonna have no idea how I built this. So let's go over to our button and we'll see what Smirky built. And let's just press this like that. And here we go here. It's all glass now. And oh my gosh. Look at Smirky's build. This thing is actually super cool looking. And it looks like it's a massive statue that he built with the world edit command. And I am so surprised he built this in two minutes. He really is stepping up his game. But wait, what is he building over there? I think he's building a subscribe button. So you know what that means. Everyone should subscribe that's watching this right now. Subscribe. The side bar me literally says to it. Okay, let's get back on my side before Smarky sees us. And anyways, I think we got a good look at his build. So let's press this button like that to set the wall back to bedrock. And Smirky, how is your build going? I think I I am done with my build, and it looks super duper good. Whoa, okay, Smirky. Well, then let's meet down at the dispenser. We can look at each other's builds. All right, well, I'm here. And let's look at yours first. And well, this thing is super cool, Smirky. Yep, it is a statue of me, as you can tell by the hat in the face. And look at what it's holding. It's holding a subscribe button, Smirky. That is so funny. And this build is actually pretty surprising. I did not think you'd be able to build this in two minutes. Yep, I went. It's super duper hard for this round, and I try hard, and so I can definitely get a point to try and win. Well, Smirky, since you spent so much time on this, instead of giving it a 0 out of 10, I'll give it a 1 out of 10. Uh, 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 1 out of 10? Are you serious, Cardi? Yes, I am, because look at my build, Smirky. Your entire build is the size of the bottom of the leg of my build. Why, you're right. And what is your build holding? I can't even load this in. I know, Smirky, it's so big as holding a giant rock. And I built this all by hand. What? Even up here, there's grass where you could build like a, a house or something. Come over to me. Yup, I know, Smirky. It's so high up that there's literally clouds here. What? What? This is actually insane. I'm gonna build my house up here now. Smirky, what the this heck? is my land. You cannot build your house here. And anyways, let's go back down there and we'll see who won. All right. Well, Cardi, I give this a zero out of ten. A zero out of ten, Smirky. Well, I don't think it's a zero out of 10. But wait, Cardi, what is this? Did you put like some kind of a uh, wooden uh, trap door thing over here? What is this? Oh, uh, uh, wait. Th this is nothing, Smirky. Don't, don't, just ignore this. Wait, what is this? This is a like a painting and what is what does this lever do here, Cardi? Oh my gosh, Smirky, I have to admit something Wait, I have to show you something. So you see this painting here? Uh, yeah, I do. Well, if we clear the painting, I can literally draw anything on it like this. So if I draw a giant red box with the word subscribe in the middle, and then I 
like go next to this lever and just pull it like this? Look at that. It literally spawns that exact thing in. What? That's actually super duper cool. But wait, does that mean you were literally drawing your build? Yes, it does, Smirk. I'm sorry for cheating. And uh, I mean, I guess we should all just listen to the subscribe button right here. Yes, we should. Subscribe now. Subscribe it. I'm sorry, Smirky, for cheating. I hope you forgive me. Okay, I do. Let's go, everyone. Please watch the video on the screen and subscribe. Subscribe, please subscribe and click the video on the screen. Bye.